Konnichiwa from Tokyo, Japan. I've just arrived from Toronto, 38 hour flight. I'm here for our Celtics pre season tour. They've got a game in Yokohama in a couple of days, which is right outside of Tokyo, and then another one in Osaka on the weekend. I'm also going to Korea, even though the game was cancelled against Wolves in Korea. I'm still going to go over to Seoul. I might go up to the DMZ up to North Korea, have an El Ganda. But then. Uh, See a fella there with a PSG jersey. Apparently PSG are over here as well, playing their pre-season. I think Real Madrid are here. Yeah, so there's a few of the big teams. No one bigger than Celtic, of course. This vlog is going to mostly be just the Celtic fans having the crack in Japan. But uh, I did used to live here, so I should probably give a few pointers for any people that actually are going to come out here on a holiday. First thing you want to do when you arrive is get yourself a SIM card. I just got one. There's the prices. So I got the 16 day one. I'm only here for 12 days, but 16 day is uh, it's about 60 quid. Um, Wi-Fi, uh, if you get that box, that's that's more expensive. That's probably double the price. So uh, yeah, get yourself a SIM card. I'm on a Just showing you my hotel here. It's called the Appa Hotel. They're all over Japan. They're very affordable. It's about. It's about $80 a night, $80 Canadian dollars. Tiny rooms, but it's nice, it's clean. And it's a good location, this is right in the heart of Rapongi. Right, for me, this is the best spot in Tokyo. The heart of Tokyo. You see this in all the films. Shinjuku. So if you see in Kill Bill when she's on the motorbike, or if you see Lost in Translation when the start of the film when uh, Bill Murray's in the taxi, that's this street right here. I'm walking into Kabuki Cho. Just the entertainment. I'm never, never gonna get back of a car. Um, the entertainment district. Or as some people call it the red light district, but I wouldn't really call it red light to be honest. So my mates are sending me the location of the pub he's at, and it's somewhere here, but I can't find it. I can't find the entrance. Yeah, I'm ringing him now to ask him to come out and, and get me. Madness. This is a Brit and he like he likes the black taxis, you know. Oh here we go. So I leave in Shinjuku and we're going out to Shibuya. How are you doing, buddy? Hello. How's it going? Hey, how do you get us, Mas? Send the guy a gojo, man. Send the guy a gojo, man. First hey. night in Tokyo. It's been a few years, about four years, five years. Been in Shinjuku, yeah. Hey, what's yeah. going on here? I don't know. Drinking. Hey, oh. <laughs> One of the best things about Japan that a lot of people don't know is that you find all these really cheap places. You get beer for 300 yen, ramen for 300 yen. You get like chicken on a stick for 300 yen as well. Um, it's called Torizuku, and every item on the menu is 300 yen. So, I mean, look at that's 900 yen. It's not even $10. Like, can you beat that anywhere else? You can't. Especially when you're locked. It's just a world famous Shibuya Crossing. That statue there is Hachiko. Um, Hachiko was a dog that uh, used to come here with his owner every day to meet his owner after work. One day the owner uh, didn't show up, he had a heart attack at work. And uh, Hachiko for the next nine years used to come at the same time every day waiting for the owner. So they say he's the most loyal dog in Japan. And here's the crossroads here, the famous Shibuya crossroads. I think I heard before like five million people cross here every day. That's on the go karts. I'm too hungover for any of that. So when I moved to Japan years ago, my first day here, I went into that Starbucks. And I was sitting there looking out at the crossroads, and a girl came over, sat beside me, and started chatting me up. And uh, yeah, that was my first day here. I was like, this is a good place. I stayed for nine more years. It's 
So heading back to the hotel now to put that Celtic jersey on. I'm going to a rebel night in uh, Rapongi, organised by a uh, famous Japanese Celtic fan, Nobu, who you'll see later, I'll get him on the video. Very well mannered, everyone standing aside, let everyone get off the train. They don't do that in Canada. This is a fella here about to get nicked, a foreign lad fighting with the cops. Yeah, he's getting nicked. He's holding a sign, but I don't know what the sign says. And who's lying on the ground? Holding the boys' jeans. <laughs> Poor man doesn't even have a belt. Oh, into the co man, into the box. Does he really think he's going to get away? Like? Welcome to Tokyo! to save me drink. There's waiters and everything. I'm making a vlog. Say hello, Yuki. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> my old friend, Yuki. So, <clears throat> oh, that's, that's a small beer. Look at the head on that. Okay. This is unbelievable. Oh, yeah. They did not, when I lived in Japan, they did not have this. This is me. This is you. Yeah, that beer's not going to last too long. So, hey, Mr. Mr. Robot, Mr. Roboto. <laughs> Can you come back in about two minutes with another beer, please? Yeah, we're waiting for the robot to come back with our beers. Oh, he's, he's at the bollocks now. I, I, I reckon you should fire him. What? How would the robot react if he got fired? <laughs> you know, just walking down the streets, just strolling down the streets. No job. 
A homeless robot. Stop right there. Here we go. One. <clears throat> and one for Yuki. The key. Now, okay, that one. Yeah. And he got us a master. Just get there. Come on. Come on. Someone else is waiting for the beer. Come all the way to Japan to see Celtic and I'm late for the game. Isn't that? Unbelievable. So you get carried away sometimes. When robots are serving you beer, you get carried away. Shout out to Ayum here, right? He loves Nakamura because he's a Marinos fan. Nakamura's a big, he's a Yokohama guy. And uh, he remembers when Yokohama scored a goal against United, the free kick, he scored two of them. But he remembers, how old were you? He's four, four years old. I was 21 in Australia. It's a guy, isn't it? <laughs> hey, I'm going to teach you English. Teach you English? Yeah, you're a new English teacher. No, no. Because I'm, I'm, I've nothing else to do. <laughs> like, I'm just, just you and me now. I might as well teach you English. Uh, but teach you. but so, I want to. I want to be a PE teacher. Ah, PE teacher. Oh. The boys here are all here to, fo to follow Celtic. Yeah. He's got yeah, the Boston yeah. Celtics Boston. top on him. <laughs> and I asked, who's your favourite uh, Japanese player? But you're like Maida. Maida. Ah, yes, yeah. Dyson Maida. Dyson. I was saying Kyogo's the superstar like for most Celtic fans. <laughs> but they love Maida. He plays on the national team. and. He scored in the World Cup. Ah, World yeah. Cup, Maida. Maida. Oh, yes, he yes, scored a goal, he did. Yes, yes, he was good. What's the story, pal? How are you? Hey, making a few quid. Right, mate. Come on. How many tickets they sold here tonight? Did I? I have no idea, mate. No way. Are you selling tickets as well? No, no, no. no. I might, I might get a scarf out of you later. Hey, Cockney lad selling scarves now. That's mad, isn't it? I wasn't expecting that. Another one. Another Cockney. So it looks like I'm not the only one that's late for the game. Look at the sky, it's beautiful. Here, lads. You show, you show, you show Niku. The lads are going to show me where to go. Apparently, we're on the other side of the stadium. Woo. Just walked in with a bag of cans. No one stops you, just show the ticket, no bother. Unreal. The Yokohama Ultras are class. Look at them at the other end. I'm here with the talent, Gary, playing the tunes. We're going to Osaka tomorrow and the day after. We're going to the day after. Let's go. So we're uh, we got we got curries and our beers. We're all locked. Well, it's, it's yeah, I do. Yeah. Want to join the Yokohama Ultras? Yes. So we go over and say hello. We're trying to get in with the Ultras. They won't let us in because they won't let colours join, understandably. So I took me put my top inside out. You can see the curry stand. So we'll, we'll see how this goes. Right? Are we doing it? Are we doing let's it? Go. Are we doing it? Come on, let's go. Right. So they won't let us go that way. So we're going to try and go through the seats. We'll see how it goes. Mission Impossible. We have ones already. Look at us. Look. The one behind me. Inside out worked. I'm, I'm making a vlog. We're right in with the hook. The score is 4 3 to Marinos. We love Marinos. We are Celtic supporters. Yeah. We love Dyson Maida. Maida. Nakamura Shunsuke. Okay. Yeah, he knew, yeah. Ichiban, I'm number Iwata, one. Iwata. Number one. Iwata more match I Marinos! Oh, yes! Here we go! Maida, Maida, Maida.
Outside the stadium, my official star selling all the all the gear. I'm getting myself a fan. I love it. They have a Celtic shop right outside the stadium. Hey, I got myself a little souvenir. Celtic in Japan, July 2023. I'll probably lose it in an hour. But uh, yeah, it's the cheapest thing they had, and it's hot. Yeah, just, we just saw the worst point of Guinness we've ever seen in our lives. Look at that. It's good. Stay in that Guinness. Stay in that Guinness, man. I'd, I'd, I'd give it back to them. I'd give it back to them. Go, Marinos. Thank you. Would you get that in Belfast? No way. by joining the Yokohama fans. I look like a proper touring coat. But uh, it, it was just a bit of fun. You know, it was, it was good crack. Look at that beast. <laughs> 